happen? What? 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 Hello, YouTube world. My name is Anthony Long. Welcome back to the Bluegrass Picker Channel. Hey, cool. Look, there's, there's people watching. Maybe. Anyway, what's sold? Uh, first thing that sold was this Wii system. I had a, a wheel, one nunchuck, one remote, one game, Battle Hot Wheels Battle Force. It was a good system, clean, uh, had all the pieces on it. Sometimes the covers aren't on there. Uh, I bought it for 85 bucks on Mercari, everything included. And it come with, let's see, one, two, three more games. And Mario Kart. I kept the Mario Kart because I could sell that for quite a bit more. And that's the reason why I bought it. It's just to have the Mario Kart. And uh, I was going to use it to sell some of my other kind of piece it together kind of deal. Um, so I, I had it listed for more, but it sold for $67.95. Um, and I'll be selling a lot more of these. I, I was hoping they go for a little bit more money because there was more shutdowns in places. So I thought they might, but. They didn't, but uh, it's okay. I get my money back easily um, when I part out the other pieces of it. I'll sell the other games individually too to get. The Mario Kart should bring me back 30 on top of that. So um, another three things are sold, and this is a good example of why not to take a best offer a lot of times. If, unless you have to have the money, um, I don't recommend it. Uh, I mean, sometimes you need to lower your price, but... Um, you take best offer a lot of times because you haven't sold anything. A lot of times you're like, take it because you just haven't sold much. And that's why you get some good stuff in garage sales. If you get there early, they don't know if they're going to sell anymore. You know the hint. Anyway, I had someone offer me. These are awesome. This one was $289. Printing plate, 101, rookie. That is an immaculate, collect, uh, an immaculate football collection. This is another one of one. Immaculate football collection and another this is the main one of the Immaculate football collection I think that's the main card <clears throat> and um, They're just each each set has different versions of this But these are all rookies from 2017 and the printing plate is one of one and there's four printing plates yellow cyan black and magenta and uh I've been setting on these a while. I got them all for about 100 to 120 bucks. 103, 120. This one was only, I bought it for 78 bucks. And, you know, this is something that how to snipe cards on eBay. You know, uh, what I do is I filter Patrick Mahomes' uh, newest and just refresh it and then snipe. I, I picked these off. Um, like some of these were like 78. It was buy it now. So I just went on there, saw it, bought it. Cause I knew it was worth more even back then. And that's before he became the MVP or before we became pro bowl MVP, super bowl MVP, super bowl champion, biggest contract in sports history. Uh, so I had these all set in at 289, 289 and 299. Well, this one, this one was 299 and I had someone just offer me $200 just the other day. Would you take $200? And I'm like, no, I, I don't. I, um, you know, cause I know the season's rolling around the people get it in their particular activating system again. Uh, they'll start looking on eBay for Patrick Mahomes, you know, uh, not that or not already because of the contract and everything in a weird year. But normally once the season starts, that's when everybody wants to start buying again. And, um, I did send him an offer. I go, well, I'll send you one. I haven't sent anybody else because I'd sent 279 out before on something like 289, 299. And I sent out 275, 99, and he didn't take it. And then the next day, someone came in, one person, and bought all three of them for the for the buy it now price. Oops, I always drop him. Uh, but they bought it for the buy it now price. And so, and that's another thing too I, I like about selling the same things. You know, I like to be diverse, but selling the same things, you have, especially when it's collectibles, the same buyers wanting the same things, you have the same things, you can sell three, $300 items real fast. So that was a nice, nice day to get all four of these sales uh, to equal almost $1,000. Um, 
Um, this is actually Mark's, the last of my three high price Mahomes cards. Um, sold through them all now. Almost all my high price cards, anything over $100 is pretty much sold. I've got a few got a few left but i bet they got a lot of watchers on them they're gonna go fast too so sports cards just blew up um uh, i'm glad it did um but who knows how long that's gonna last um i hope it does but i'm not gonna bank on it that's why i like to do all these other things trucker hats uh antiques uh video equipment video games um so um just another uh little hint on how to snipe some things off of eBay or Mercari. Uh, you can find some stuff there too. Um, and then buy lots. I used to buy lots of Patrick Holmes rookies, the cheap ones, for 10 to 15 bucks for 10 cards back when he, no one knew about him. And now I can sell each one of those for 50 to 100. Um, so yeah, some of it's luck and scouting. I, I kind of, I'm a scout of sports, so that helps. Um, but once you know you have someone that you like that you think's going to be good, you snipe them and, and know what the price of everything's going for. And then uh, uh, that's how that's how you can flip eBay to eBay, which, you know, just gets sent in the mail to me in the mail, and I send it out in the mail, so that makes it a lot easier to go into garage sales and this and that too. So, you know, e-commerce flips are pretty awesome, and we might have to be doing more of that anyway. So um, uh, e-com and beyond, right? Uh if you don't watch the uh, morning show with uh, Anthony Pittsburg and Nate at uh, Every Damn Hustling, it's a it's a good morning show, and they talk about Amazon and, and these kind of things too, and, and so uh, you might check them out. But uh, grind on, friends. Bye from Bluegrass Pickers. <laughs> Stay tuned.